world's guide. The concept of the edge of the universe can be a bit tricky to grasp because it's closely tied to our understanding of the structure and expansion of the universe. To clarify, there are two key terms you mentioned, observable universe and observable points. Let's break them down. 1. Observable universe. This refers to the portion of the universe that we can observe or see from our vantage point on Earth. It is limited by the age of the universe and the speed of light. Since the universe has a finite age, about 13.8 billion years old, we can only see objects or regions of space whose light has had enough time to reach us. Anything beyond this limit is said to be beyond the observable universe. Size of observable universe the observable universe is estimated to be about 93 billion light years in diameter. This might seem paradoxical since the universe is only about 13.8 billion years old, but it's because the universe has been expanding during its existence. This expansion means that objects that were once closer to us have moved farther away due to the stretching of space. 2. Observable points. This term isn't commonly used in cosmology. It might refer to specific points or objects within the observable universe that astronomers observe and study. These points could be galaxies, stars, or other celestial objects. Now, let's address the concept of the edge of the universe. Based on our current understanding of cosmology, the universe doesn't have a physical edge or boundary in the traditional sense. Instead, it's thought to be either infinite or very close to it. This idea is supported by various observations, such as the fact that the universe appears to be homogeneous and isotropic on large scales, meaning it looks roughly the same in all directions, and the absence of any evidence for a boundary. So, there isn't a well-defined edge that one could travel to and reach the end of the universe. Instead, the observable universe has its limits because of the finite speed of light and the age of the universe. Beyond what we can observe, the universe continues, but it's beyond our current observational capabilities. In summary, the observable universe is limited by the age of the universe and the finite speed of light, and there isn't a physical edge to the universe as we understand it. Observable points refer to objects within our observable universe, such as galaxies and stars, which astronomers study to learn more about the cosmos. World's Guide